Hey guys, I'm here with my favourites for September. Uh, I don't have a lot this month, but um, I do have a few things. So I thought I'd get this video up and show you guys what I have been loving this month. The first thing here is actually a newer purchase uh, for this month. I've been using it for about just over a week now, uh, but I thought I'd include it anyway. And it's the new Nivea In Shower Body Lotion. I'm sure you've probably seen the ads. That's how I knew about it and we actually got some shipped into my work so I thought I'd give it a go I got the one for normal to dry skin uh, there is one for dry to very dry skin but I don't think my skin's that dry but it does get dry that's for sure I really like the smell of this product and I like the feel that it gives my skin after I get out of the shower so um, I do find that I don't need to moisturize afterwards which is great for a bit of a time saver for me as well a couple of oldies but goodies I have been really enjoying using this month is the first one, my Benefit Erase Paste. I use number one Fair and I use that as my concealer. Um, so I've been using it a lot on its own and also underneath the Rimmel Wake Me Up concealer as well if I feel that I need that little bit of extra coverage. I absolutely love this concealer. It's one of my favorites and I haven't been using it for a little while so it was great to sort of rediscover that again. The next one you will recognize it is a huge hit here on YouTube and that is the Australis Fresh and Flawless Powder. Now I finished my recent one. I've had this one for a little while but I started using it again after my last one ran out and yeah I really love this powder it just gives a really nice finish and I find that um, I don't get oily and that sort of thing throughout the day so I really do love this powder. A bit of a fashion favorite is this bag it's just one of those sort of flippy over bags I don't know what their official name is and it's all studded and it's got a chain a long chain so I like to wear that on an angle and I've been wearing this um, or using this a little bit this month uh, because I've been doing a lot of going out and that sort of thing um, and I find that my massive bag that I normally carry is way too big so this is perfect if I just need to chuck a few things in it. The next thing I have been absolutely loving is a candle. This is a party light three wick jar candle and it is in pomegranate and cassis. Whatever cassis is, I don't know, but it smells amazing. I just, oh, I love it. It's a bit citrusy. And yeah, I've been really enjoying burning this candle. The last favorite for the month is this perfume and is the Victor and Rolf Flower Bomb perfume. Um, I've been wearing it pretty much every day and you can see I've used quite a bit there. I actually won this in a her fashion box competition, which is great because it's worth like $200 and I definitely cannot justify spending that much on a perfume so extremely excited and lucky to have won this so thank you uh, her fashion box for that and yeah I really love it it's just so it's sort of sweet and floral it's very fruity but not overpoweringly fruity but it's probably a bit more floral than fruity I'm really bad at describing these things but yeah I really love it and I think it's going to be great for this time of year for spring and summer. So that is it guys for my favorites for the month so that was a bit short and sweet. I hope you guys liked this video. If you guys have any favorites or any questions you have about mine please comment below and let me know and don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram for all those regular random updates from my life and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.